Biden thanked Verizon and ATT for agreeing to postpone 5G deployment around key airports. President Joe Biden has thanked wireless carriers Verizon and ATT for agreeing to delay 5G deployment around key airports and to continue working with the Department of Transportation on safe 5G deployment at this limited set of locations. Verizon and ATT are launching high-speed 5G service across the United States Wednesday. Despite the telecom giant's exemption to airports, some foreign airlines, including Emirates, ANA and Japan Airlines, cancelled some US flights over concerns that high-tech radio signals could interfere with navigational systems on their aircraft. We are working closely with aircraft manufacturers and the relevant authorities to alleviate operational concerns, and we hope to resume our US services as soon as possible, Dubai-based Emirates Airlines said in a statement. FAA had warned the 5G service could interfere with some sensitive equipment on board certain aircraft, such as long-haul aircraft Boeing 777. Biden said in a statement that Verizon and ATT's agreement will avoid potentially devastating disruptions to passenger travel, cargo operations, and U.S. economic recovery, while allowing more than 90% of wireless tower deployment to occur as scheduled. This agreement protects flight safety and allows aviation operations to continue without significant disruption and will bring more high-speed internet options to millions of Americans, he added. My team has been engaging non-stop with the wireless carriers, airlines, and aviation equipment manufacturers to chart a path forward for 5G deployment and aviation to safely coexist, and at my direction, they will continue to do so until we close the remaining gap and reach a permanent, workable solution around these key airports," Biden said. Expanding 5G and promoting competition in internet service are critical priorities of the Biden administration. For comments and feedback contact, editorial at artnews.com. Biotech stocks facing FDA decision in January 2022. Biotech stocks facing FDA decision in December 2021. Biotech stocks facing FDA decision in November 2021.